Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite the Explosive One. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I am the man on the sticks. We're playing Madden 20, new team relocated. Dude, we're, we brought back the Houston Oilers, dude. Look, they're back. Baby Blues and oil fields. So the Houston Oilers went the way of the Cleveland Browns in what year? Uh, 99 or 2000, 99. something, no, maybe something, something like 2001, somewhere around there. And they moved to Tennessee, the Titans. Oddly oh. enough, I took the Tennessee Titans, deconstructed <laughs> them and moved them back to Houston. Retribution yeah, for the dude, fallen team. But yeah. Houston, Houston has another team. Yes. And they're in our division. So we'll play them twice a year. We'll have the battle of Houston for the rights right. to be Houston. So Houston. Hey, so just like when the Browns turned into the Ravens and then they Browns got a new team, but we just called them the Browns still. Yeah. Kind of a missed opportunity if you ask me. Yeah. But, you know, who am I? The same thing happened in Houston where they lost their team. They became the. Tennessee Titans. Y yes, but see, the only difference is, before we get rolling with everything, the Browns, when they left, part of the deal of them leaving was they kept their history. So the new team is the Browns. All the records are the Browns records, everything. When Houston, the Oilers went to Tennessee, that all went with the team. So Warren Moon's records for like Houston count with the Titans, where the huh. Texans are a brand new history, brand new franchise. Really? Yes. Why did they relinquish that? Because I don't know. Maybe they didn't think they gave you. I don't know, dude. I that's, don't know. That's kind of weird. But as always, we're playing offense only. We're simming that D, using the balanced playbook, and playing on all the Madden arcade. The so yeah, dude, we're, we're we got a brand new group, dude. Take the freaking Oilers, dude. Dude, and we're the Oilers. We got the baby blues. I, I kept the traditional uniform. Like right. I didn't even use. This is like the 1980 uniform. I'm fine with that, actually. Yeah, dude. So we're we're gonna cruise around, man. Our quarterback. Brand new rookie. Ooh. Ooh. Star Boy's already getting me. We got good old Brody White as QB. Brody White. QB in it up. Brody Six Shooter. What? I don't even know. We need to get a nickname. <laughs> what did I say? It was Brody Six Guns? Brody Six. Brody. Yeah, something like that. Brody Six Guns. <laughs> Oh, he's number one too. So oh, it's like yeah. Warren Moon, dude. He's like it's like the second coming uh, oh, okay. of Warren Moon. Oh, there's Jonu Smith. Wait, what? His name is Jonu. Are you related? Yes, it's my long lost cousin, oh, Jonu and Jonas. That's so good, first man. names are what top of the race. <laughs> that's good. I'm glad you guys know yeah, each other. Yeah, dude. I, it's been a long time. I haven't seen him in, in, a, in a while. He's black. You know that, right? Yeah, dude. Okay. I got, I got I'm, I'm all just, sorts of family in all places. There we go. Oh, there's Nyheim Hines. We traded for him from the Colts. Yeah. Because our running back, dude, I was going to keep the real Titans running back. That didn't work out. After two weeks of the season, I tried to resign him, and he was like, no, I'm going somewhere else. And I was like, oh, you're going somewhere else right now. And I traded him for Nyheim Hines. <laughs> I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but it's N Y H E I M Hines. H I N E S. Okay. So, dude, I don't know, but that's who we got. And then we got AJ Brown and Demarcus Robinson, our wide receiver. AJ Brown, I believe, is a real boy. That was a little bit of interference. <laughs> Not but according I, to the game. And then Demarcus Robinson, I believe, is too. See, here's our. Okay. I guess not. It was going to show us our uh, running back class. And uh, it didn't. So. Um, I'm, you know what? Oilers. Nice. It's an old team. Um, wholesome. They don't, you know. Wow, dude, they crush Polson. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's not offensive to any, in any, anybody. Which, oh, you know. boy, and our running back got hurt on the first. <laughs> Who, which one is it? Who is it? Nyheim? Look, he's still down the middle of the field. No one's helping. No, knee highs. Uh, he's holding his arm, and it'll be like, injured his leg. Dude, you don't even need that arm. All right, dude. Well, I guess uh, I'm glad I signed Peyton Barber, who's our second string. So we maybe have to maybe the Barber of Houston. If Tiki and Peyton had a baby. Yeah, if, they, if that was, oh, my God, dude. We are, wow, we are not starting out well, dude. 
The, the Steelers D is yeah, Bruce dude. Sternum. Are you surprised that the Steel D would be <laughs> dude, anything if else? But D, it's gonna be hard. Yeah. So at least we got who's our kicker? I don't even know who our kicker. Oh, we got oh we got Jay Styles as our kicker. Oh, oh Jay Sly. I mean. Jay Sly. I like Joey that. Sly. Jay Sly. <laughs> Mr. Sly. Yeah, dude. So he's the Sly you Fox. You monster. So we got three. Now we're down, dude. I don't know what to expect, man. We may lose. Do you have a last man. name like Sly? Why is Nyheim got it? So let's see how the how the barber does. Is he gonna, is he gonna get a fade? Is he gonna get everybody faded? I mean, what? <laughs> what, dude? <laughs> what? <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> Do you know what that means? You know, fade has like a bunch of different meanings to it. It's crazy. All right, let's break them down. You want to break down some fade? I, I know what faded when it comes to a haircut Absolutely. is, you know, like a fade. You know, it's like, but how would you describe a fade? A gradient of hair? Yeah, it goes from a... Uh, Bald to slowly no, not. No, that's a taper fade. Yeah. That's a taper fade, just like fading the hair, just the general. This is like a short cut, a buzz cut. Baby. Yeah, but it, but it's like it gradually gets longer. But yeah, but that's when you, that's a taper fade. But yeah, I guess you, they usually go together. They just call it fade. Either way, that's fade. And then you got faded in the Snoop Dogg sense, which means to partake in the use of illegal narcotic until one loses his uh, cognitive ability. Yeah, right. You're faded. Dude. I think everybody's done there. And then to catch a fade. Catch a fade, okay. That's to get into a fight. To catch a fade, yeah. really? Yeah. I've never heard that before. Oh, Richmond's a fade. And then both oh, of you get up. Same as the smoke, dude. And then both of you get up, and then you begin to fade. <laughs> oh, Jonu, dude. He's oh, he's back, dude. He's the, the Jonu assassin, dude. What are, we, what are we gonna call this? I don't like dude. calling him Smith. I like calling him Jonu. Jonu, okay. Jonu, dude. Jonas and Jonu sitting in a tree, dude. The Jonu connection. Six guns to Jonu. But uh, yeah, so that's that's uh, American Ebonics for you. Congratulations. Okay. So uh, Brody confusing. White's background, his father was an oil tycoon. What, it was a lifelong dream <laughs> 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 to, no. to play no. for the Oilers. No. <laughs> no. Okay. Thank God. That's not it. He's, he's just a six-gun oh, shooter, God. bro. I can't, I can't do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Are we talking about Ergamonte and his top I can't, I can't live that life. <laughs> no, nah, dude, he's just Brody White. He's six months. Dude, I'm almost 40, all right? <laughs> just letting you be known. Just let it be known. I'm almost 40. Brody White's on the run. Oh, my God, he's slow. There we go. <laughs> See how he slid? Yeah, dude, it was very white. It looked like he was jumping in the bed. <laughs> <laughs> He's all like, uh, you in the bed tonight, honey? And then he didn't. That's it, dude. <laughs> all right, let's see how, how we do. Why is, where are our friends not Oh, Schneid's dad. No snakes. We, we got crunched. I mean, we're still winning, man. How, how are they feeling, Jonas? How do they feel? This is your first well, time really behind the wheel. Yeah, dude. I, I mean, I built the team myself yeah. as the owner. You know, I'm the owner. I know everything about these boys. Yeah, you made the team. So how does it feel behind the wheel, man? How's, how's the braking? How's the handling so far? Oh, uh, it's scary. Dude, it's like when you get a new car. You don't really... Oh, Melvin just took it to the house. I believe that's our rookie. Oh, he's, he's got rookie, some, rookie, rookie first connection. First and he's got some dance moves. Yeah, dude, That's the most important thing. Um, you know, like when the first time, like say you drive like a car all the time, and then like you get behind the wheel of an SUV. It's just like a little form oh, and is that, unfamiliar. Is that what it is? Yeah. <laughs> it's like it's, yeah, dude. It's like I'm driving a car that I'm not really used to yet. It's like test driving a, but is it like test driving like a BMW, or is it like test driving a certified use from JD Byers? He's off, dude. He greased them up. What they do in the locker room is they use the oil and they grease each other up before the game. <laughs> Boom. Fair enough. Yeah, dude. I mean, they, they got to use their resources. So what kind of car does it feel like you're driving? Is it like a certified used or is it like, a, you know, an Audi SI, SA5? I feel like what's a very underrated car brand? That, like at first you think, oh, man, this isn't good. And then you get in, you're like, ah. Okay. Nis Nissan Altima? Yeah, dude. Nissan, it's a Nissan Altima football team. <laughs> <laughs> you get in there, you're like, wow, dude, all of are great cars. <laughs> Feel you, dude. I'm gonna tell you right now, man. Ain't the best. It's good. It is what it is. Dude. Please get it, Melvin. Nope. Oh. 
I got scared because there was a boy coming at us. And this so. is the thing. I don't know how hard their D is, so <laughs> it may be easier for you against other teams with less uh, in, yeah, dude, intense D. Yeah, they, instead of it being like a diamond cut D, it's like a... Uh, Arbor, dude, get it! The fleet street! All right. These guys are not easy boys, dude. Now the Steelers gonna use yeah, I mean, it's always – what is it? Yeah, I got a punt, dude. Oh, who's our punter? Some guy. You named him. His name was uh, – I don't name him. I no, I remember. Yeah, I just, uh, you, you, we went through the names. Townsend, I think, is his name. Okay. I didn't mean you named him. We went through the names. So I don't remember what his was. Oh, I didn't I didn't get to the – I only did the offense. I didn't even show you the defense. We, our D is – our D has a mind of its own. Is our, do we got dirty D or we got like clean, good, healthy D? Uh, we got, dude, there's a nice, I, mean, I did a lot better job paying attention to what was going on. I built a nice little team for us here, dude. We, our D, I feel, is nice, clean, strong, strong, clean D. No, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. No, I mean, you can beat your D, you can beat but it. you can't always beat your D. You, know you can't I mean? beat it with two hands, guys. Yeah, dude, it's, we got six guns. Bro, Oh, oh nice opening. Boom, he smacked him, dude. All right. <laughs> Barber, are you going to take over for Hines, dude? I don't think so. I'm cool. I like Hines. I like his name. Maybe we'll just maybe we'll do a split with a timeshare. <laughs> can you do that? Yeah, yeah, I can set it so uh, the players play. The player's going to play. Oh, dude, Robinson. Oh, you're going to pull down by his mask? Look at that, dude. That's a flag. I'll take it. Nisking. So if okay, you know how they do a three-letter um, abbreviation for the team. Why is H U S? That seems like the least like H O U. H O U. That's a college though. Yeah, but no, it's like the abbreviation on the scoreboard. Brown, dude. Oh, he's oh my standing God. up. <laughs> Freaking suplexes, butt, man. Yeah, dude. Brody White, six guns, is showing why he was drafted. Oh, what, dude? Oh, you got it. Oh, my God. We got concussed on that one. Got it, man. What? You gave him the nickname. I did give him the nickname. I, I did. I'm, I'm proud of the nickname, honestly. I like it, dude. My name is... Yours, you're Joni Two Guns. You got different gun amounts, man. Dude, why does he get more guns than I do? I don't know. Honestly, it's more prestige the less amount of guns you got. Oh, okay. Cool. It smells like Joni Half Gun. It would be like. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. Woo. It's like golf. Be legit. It's like golf. Jonu. Do it, buddy. And that's oh, Jonu coming through in the clutch again. And that's why I'm TNT Dynamite. We don't even talk about the gun. Wow, dude. <laughs> Real killers move in silence, Jonas. Wow, 31 to 7, dude. We're Wait, what is bad. it? <laughs> Real G's are silenced like lasagna. Oh, is that is real that G's move in silence like lasagna? Because there's a silent G in lasagna. Ah, dude, that's, a, that's, a, that's a Wayne. Real G's are next. That's a that's a little Wayne lyric. I mean, Wayne's got some flow, dude. I don't know. It was kind of lame, but yeah. it, 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 at the same time, I mean, it, it's kind of like miracle, yeah, miracle. Sometimes, like when they say stuff, it isn't so much. What they're saying, it's like the, the cleverness of what they're saying. Yeah. yeah. Like I heard some guy in a rap song uh, say, it's a new era, no Mitchell and Nesta. And I'm like, because it's like a new era hat and they have those Mitchell and Nesta. I was like, that was, that's clever. I'm like, I'll give you the clever piece on that. But that's about all I'll give you on that. That's about all I'll give you. Yeah, I mean, it's cool and all, man. I got you, but. Yeah, this ain't Space Jam, it's Blue Chips. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's what my whole life is like. If, it, if I could have blue chips or Space Jam, I think I'm taking. Ah, sacked by a star boy. You just remind me that Shaq just got into a rap battle with Jamie Lillard. Uh, I saw something about that. Yeah, yeah. And he pretended it didn't exist. <laughs> it was actually some, what entertaining just to hear Shaq rap again. Dude, Shaq Diesel from like 1990. <laughs> Dude, Shaq that was like the worst thing in the entire world. Dude, he had a cartoon. Yeah, he did. He he Shaq a, food video game. Video game, the cartoon, the shoes, the lunchbox. Oh, bro, dude, he did it. 
Always jumping Brown is A.J. Brown right there. Nice you know, the lunchbox the industry yards. must be in a freaking tailspin right now. Why? Kids don't buy a lunchbox. <laughs> Where is that? Wow, okay. I don't know. I just started thinking about the Shaq lunchbox branding, and I was like, kids don't Dude, we used to sit. I remember being like a kid, and like everyone would sit their lunchbox up, and they pretend like it was a TV, and they'd be like, because it was all like that. It always had a picture on the front of something weird. They'd be like, oh, man, you got Transformers on your lunchbox. I'm like, oh, dude, I got Mario, and he's jumping out. I had, oh dude, I had, I, I had a Mario Brothers one, that, I also had one that I got in Canada when I was a little kid, Yeah. and it was like, instead of it being like the front flip down on it, it was like a, it was like tall and skinny, and it broke in half, and it had a little thermos on the inside. Oh, okay, dude, everyone that. thought that was the bomb, because no one else had one, dude. Yeah, I was like, look at the thermos. Do you remember the Yeah, dude, they put soup in them. It was so bad, too. It didn't work at all. Oh, brown. Yeah, dude, you put soup in it. Your chicken noodle soup be all over the dang cosmos. That company made a killing. There was a there was actually a company, and they were called, what was it? Lunchboxes? Was it Thermos? Yeah, Thermos. I mean, they still are very popular because for, for, like, people who work real jobs, they have, like, legit thermoses. So is that is the word Thermos? Oh, it's, like, one of those things where it's, like, the word is taking over the industry? No, the industry is taking over the word. Well, yeah, because cause tissues are what they're called, but people yeah. call them Kleenex because... They're, they're facial tissues. Yeah, people call them Kleenex because that's the brand. So, it, yeah, are they really called Thermoses? Or band or, Yeah, or Thermos is the big brand, so everybody calls them Thermos. Yeah. Are they called, like, can keeping containers or something? <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. Insulated, insulated mugs. Insulated, <laughs> insulated, insulated, insulated free carrying device. Insulated food tubes. That's a, I like that, dude. <laughs> like food tubes? Insulated food tubes? Dude, that sounds really cool. Jonas like, loves the tube, man. He's always talking about the tube. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yep, me and me and tubes. Might you, as well be a tube boy. You walk in here, you're like, hey, turn on the boob tube. Yeah, dude, how many tubes you had today, bro? Hey, get your tubes tight. <laughs> yes. I'm like TNT. Oh my God, we keep getting sad. I mean, we're winning. <laughs> Walking up to random ladies. Hey, get your tubes. Hey, <laughs> tight tubes. Hey, how your tubes doing today, ma'am? Ma'am, I want to talk to you about your tubes. How are they? <laughs> Quickest way to get the police called on you. I don't know if you can get the police called on you for just being an a hole. Yeah, dude, I get it. <laughs> Like if you oh try my god, I tried to lower my shoulder and he dead. Yeah, me. he's clothesline you. Clothesline from hell from Terry Hawk Bradshaw. That's really good yeah, dude, I'm going to do a uh, D move. I'm going to let the clock go down to one second, call timeout, and then do a big pass to try to end the game. I think if you tried to tie a woman's tubes into Walmart, then the cops would get Like if I literally tried to tie her tubes for Yeah, yeah, dude. You're just like, I'm just going to tie your tubes. Oh, don't mind me, lady. I'll just tie your tubes. Just bust through her abdominal cavity with your fist. Uh, that would be hard. Okay. Okay, I'm mean, illegal. <laughs> that's what a cops get called, Jonas. Oh, I got you. See? Okay, yeah. all right, I see. see. You. All right, that's, all right. yeah, that's, that's <laughs> in different. Here, here at the crazy town, we only discuss the most important things. Yeah, dude, like if you try to tie somebody's tubes yeah, in Walmart without their permission, that's illegal. Yes. You can't do that. Yeah, kids, don't try to tie anybody's you tubes. Don't dare tie anybody's tubes without their permission, dude. Yeah, consent. Brody White, why don't we get one more sack before we wrap the game up, so. <laughs> now, if a young lady comes up to you and says, hey, little Johnny, can you tie my tubes for me? It's like, yes. Think about it. Yeah, think about it first. Yeah, Weigh the options. Back, isn't it? Well, the first game went pretty well. Uh, we won. Watch a YouTube video. Video on it. So, but TNT you know, Dynamite, that is all the time we have for today's episode. Yeah. Everybody out there, please make sure to uh, subscribe, like the video, and the best thing you can do is share the content with your friends. Get us out there, man. Mm. But for Jonas, catch you on the next one. We are over. So, for the home team here, it's a